So, all right, y'all. This is like take two of trying to start this vlog because I tried to start it on Friday and it was dark and gloomy. But, um, yeah. So, I tried to start this like on Friday, but it was raining, it was gloomy. Then I got into this funk, this spell basically, where I, and then, you know, I am about to get my period too, but like, I, I feel like a lot happened last year that I didn't even get to like share, you know? I've been keeping a lot of stuff to myself and that's not good and I learned that. Please don't let me start crying now, Lord, please. <laughs> and I said, you know, if I'm gonna vlog my life, I'm gonna vlog the parts that are not so pleasant or not so cute or something like that because we all need a community. We need a community. We need to be able to vent and understand. And I realized that a lot of stuff that I've been doing is certain stuff like how my mom has been doing. Like, like I'll tell people like, oh, yeah, you got to give it to God. You got to pray and blah, blah, blah. And then I'm realizing that I'm not... I'm giving it to God, but I still need to release it. Like we are in partnership for a reason. We are here together for a reason. So, you know, and hold on y'all. Oh. Yeah, that's better. So like we are in partnership. We are here for a reason. Like, you know, there are things that we all go through and we need to experience stuff so you can give it to god you can do all that stuff but you still need to let it out and let it go and you still need to have somebody to talk to so i am going to be looking for a therapist because i realize like if i don't have that community or that friend or that like you know what i'm saying like sometimes you just want people to give you a hug and just give you a hug filled with love you know what i'm saying and Dang, you know, I lost a lot last year. Like, and I'm not talking about financial. I'm talking about people. And I had to be okay with it. You know what I'm saying? Like, we have to be okay with these things. And, you know, we had a lot of letdowns last year. I'm pretty sure y'all can relate to it. And I'm just like, yo, this is just... It's a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot to keep going through. So, and I don't have... I, the, the reason why I was break, child, I can't do that without that. So the reason why I'm gonna be honest, y'all, the reason why I was breaking down so bad is that I realized that I don't have a healthy relationship with my parents. Like I was praying and, and hoping and, and, and I know it takes time, but I'm like, yo, I'm in my thirties and I can't even go to my mom or my father. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like I can't. There's like my mom, she doesn't want to listen to nothing. I love her to death, but she's just not that parent. And she's just, you know, she doesn't even really stuff. And then my father, me and my father have had this weird, crazy relationship all my life. You know what I'm saying? We went 16 years without talking. So it's like, God darn, like, can I get a somebody? You know what I'm saying? Like somebody.
don't care. But we're going out for a walk because we've been in the house a little bit too long. Um, King decided that he wanted to pee in the house. <laughs> Maybe because he's bored, he wanted attention. I don't know. I was just we were just cuddling, put him down. I was getting ready to get ready, so he went in time out for that. Then we stepped out, and he has this bad habit of barking at people he doesn't know. Um, and he was like that when I got him, when I adopted him and I'm, I'm we, we tired of it. We said in 2023, we're going to break bad habits. We're going to break generational stuff. We're going to do all types of stuff because the enemy is coming locked and loaded. Y'all know, I already know I've been in the funk for days. I was just talking about how, oh, this year I don't have holiday or seasonal depression. And it damn sure felt like I went right into that, like towards the end of the year. And, you know, it was me in thought process, you know, like I told y'all the other day with my, um, just the family and, and feeling alone and stuff like that. So we, we're not going to keep entertaining this. We not, I, I want to break down and cry right now, but it's not going to solve nothing. I feel like I've been crying enough. I don't feel like there's anything that need to be coming out. So we're going to go outside for a walk, but Y'all, this vlog is to just be honest and fully transparent. You know, I'm preaching and talking to y'all about things all the time. And, and I told y'all there's things that I've already walked through, but there's things that I'm currently walking through that I be sharing with y'all. And this is something that I'm probably going to always have to walk through because every time you turn around, it's going to be something in your life that is just not going to feel good. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be times with something old. And I feel like I've been hearing all day today, like I was purging the old, like I was like, basically the old me was dying. Cause I felt like this before. And it's always when something is about to break off of me, like right in that moment. So I'm thinking like just certain mindsets, certain habits, but, um, I wanted to show y'all because he in the corner. <laughs> so he's been up here for a while. So he's losing his balance. But he's very, very dirty. I know y'all see that. Don't look at me. Turn your head. King, turn your head. Thank you. And um, he's losing his balance. He's been up here. This is his second time because we, we're not doing that. You can get down now. Come on. So like I was saying, um, everybody correct, correct your animal, correct your kids, discipline them how you want to. Some, some people don't think it's right to do that, but I'm not about to sit up here and allow the behavior that we've been talking about for two, boy, stay on one side for two years because he is very privileged, put it like that. He's very privileged. I'm not going to say spoiled. Cause I'm not gonna speak that on him, but he's very privileged. And when he goes to my aunt's house, they baby him, act like he's a baby. <laughs> and he's acting up because I lose him head in the leash, but we are going for a walk. And sometimes y'all, y'all just gotta get out the house, like to get some fresh air. Like if you going through stuff, it's probably because you're too much on social media. You're too much on the phone, on the computer, playing games. In the house, by yourself, secluded, and you feel like that. So, get out the house and move around. Even go to family. If you have family, go to family. If you don't have family, go to like a place where it's a nice scenery. Because I know every time when I do that, I feel better, but... I don't know what the heck it is. It's like I said, I think something is breaking off on me because, child. Whew. Look how this building looks. That's coming together nicely, except all of this crap that's in this area. But this is coming up again, like, nicely. I'm not even gonna charge your arm in the leg. <laughs> So as y'all can see, 
it's nighttime yet again. It's 506. And um I am I need to go grocery shopping, but I'm gonna wait till tomorrow because I go back to work tomorrow. Um and then that way I can get some other like you know, some good stuff. I need some <sighs> some good vegetables, some healthiness. But right now I'm on my way to get me some. I should have went to the other store. Cause I could have got me some chamomile tea. But I just finished filling up air in my tires. Which I wish I would have got that last one over there. I put more in where I'm sitting at because of course it's usually me in the car and that thing was low, y'all. That thing was low, 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 low. And the only one that wasn't low is the passenger side, which makes no sense because I have more people in the passenger side. Like, I don't get it. Not in the back seat. So it's weird. Anyway. Um, you know what I realized, too? Like, God reminded me of something. Like, I literally was about to put air in my, th in my tire. I was like, I remember around this last year, around this time. I wonder if I could find that clip. But, um, I had uh, hit a pothole in my whole right tire just like slowly but like fast because it was within 10 minute time i had a whole i didn't have a tire so i'm like why am i why am i why am i so sad right now i guess because like i said I, you know i would love to be i feel like i'm alone pretty much so I know for those ones that can relate, but like, I'm like, why am I? Like, I'm, I got so many things I need to be, like, I'm thankful and grateful for. And this year, even though a lot of stuff didn't happen the way I would have liked it to, but this year, let's just focus on the controllable. Like, I'm going to snap out of this mood no matter what. And King is over here cleaning his feet. Well, he's not finna get a bath. Anyway, let's go in here and get some. I was trying to say I, I need some chamomile tea and sparkling water. That's what I was trying to say. Anyway, let's go. Look how dirty he is, guys. Look. This is what happens when you have a white dog. And he likes to wallow on the ground and play in leaves. Right, King? And then they eat everything on the floor. Yo, I had the heat on 80 in the, in the house just now. And my back is sweating because I'm feeling 10 times better, y'all. Like, 10 times better. Like, prayer, I, don't, I like, prayer, I read my scriptures this morning. And I decided, like, I'm just not about to stay in this funk. I'm not about to do this. Like, we, we don't, we, we can't keep entertaining that because it happens. It's okay. And I always say you can rest there but just don't live there. Ooh just that's the preview of what's to come um and i just i just don't have time to be sitting up here i don't got time to be wasting god didn't gave me another year to see i got i've been able to see my my birth year and i've been able to see the calendar year so like come on now like i gotta be grateful and thankful and stop being in the funk and you know i am sad because i do want to have this amazing wonderful family but I know it's coming. It might not be bloodline related the way I would like it, but I know I'm going to be also an amazing mom too because of the things that I had to go through. But I also know that I'm going to have my own things I'm going to have to learn about. So, but anyway, that's enough. That's enough. Guys, I got to go. Woo. All right, y'all. So it is the 7th of January. And I told myself, I said, self self said what i said i'm going to the gym 
You've been procrastinating. You've been making excuses. Everybody talking about new year, new me, or whatever. So said, you always say that. I said back to self, but we're not going to play that. Because it ain't even about just getting in shape. It's about getting your mental together. You need to get your mental together. You know how we're, a working out was a stress reliever for you. You feel me? You feel me? You feel me? So, I just spent a hundred and something dollars on some stuff because, you know, I, I know everybody. And I, I just lose it on be with this. I lose it. Guys, I'm losing it on this time person i be trying to get ahead of the game i usually start like back in september i would have started but for some reason you feel me like i was just like you know you know like i was really like tripping tripping like you know what i'm saying so okay y'all before i hit stop at the gym y'all probably like this girl is bsing i'm going in because i need to stop at dsw because they sell crocs and I need some work Crocs because the Croc, the regular Crocs, you can't wear to work. And I've been, well, they say you can't wear it. And sometimes I see people doing it. And I've been seeing people doing it. And my feet been hurting. Because one, I'm way too big. Okay, let's just be honest. Your girl, she chunky. She chunky. Well, I'm going to show y'all when I get home what I look like. But, um... Ooh, that was ghetto. That was real ghetto. That was ghetto ash. Hey, ghetto ash. How you doing? Um, and two, we work on cement floors. And I've been working there for 13 years. I'm Damn! Oh, I know, I know. A loyal, a loyal, loyal a servant. Um, not like on some sleep, but child by um but there's people that work there longer and they all we all be talking about how our feet and our knees even people that work there less it's like it's just it's doing too much so i'm gonna go in here real quick and y'all gonna come with me and then we're gonna hit the gym i really do want to stop it also because i want to see something real quick about a, a wax thing so let's go real quick work <laughs> I don't know how I ended up. How did I end up in freaking TJ Maxx? But look what I'm looking at. What did I do with this? Why do I want this so bad? Why? Where would this go? There's no aesthetic. Unless I get that bookcase that I want. Then if I ain't shoes in DSW. But some say come to TJ Maxx, not something, but the Holy Spirit. And guess what? Booyah. I got them for even cheaper. I'm yeah, so I know I'm redecorating really my bathroom, living room, and kitchen. So that's what I'm looking for. I got another neutral bullet. I'm so excited because I love neutral bullet kind of. But I'm like, what am I going to do with my open?
y'all we are done so today this is the first day i'm not gonna burn myself out even though i wanted to i'm not gonna lie to you i wanted to get on that whoo y'all i wanted to get on the i forgot what machine it was but i wanted to do back i want to do all that stuff and i had to listen to the spirit say like relax calm down because we're trying to build a consistency we don't want to burn ourselves out and it was crazy because i'm listening to an auto an auto uh, book and i decided to listen to this one well i already know why sex is worth the wait but it's by a guy that used to be a stripper so i was like let me listen to this you know what i'm saying like i can't listen to trap music no more because i should have changed my hoodie it's cool now Ooh, child. um i can't listen to trap music no more because that music especially nowadays like some certain songs from back in the day i can listen to certain songs i can listen to but all of that i'm i'm a bust her down i'm a mm -mm, i can't it, it just it rubs me the wrong way too on top of that it's just like why am i listening to this dumb stuff like i'm not knocking y'all but y'all gotta listen to what you are feeding yourselves not just what you're eating but what you're eating you get what i'm saying what you're consuming the music the shows all of that stuff because it has uh influence we are meant to be influenced by certain things you know what i'm saying um and the enemy has used it and confused us into us thinking that this is what we're supposed to do but anyway because i ain't finna keep talking y'all see my <laughs> also excited Okay, so where did it go? Ah, uh, yeah, I've been, you know, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I've been trying to switch it up. Are you finished? That girl was thirsty. Um, I need y'all to keep me in order. I'm going to just park right here. I need y'all to keep me in order. Y'all need to watch me spend this money. Y'all, not, not watch me like that, but I mean watch me. Don't watch me and let me do it. I mean, y'all need to correct me because we ain't finna be doing... Child, I'm about to put my whole... I want to change my hoodie so bad because my back is sweating, like... And it's that time, it's that time to get it. And this damn jacket, I'm not zipping it up because I done gained weight. This is a large, but this should be, excuse me. Ooh. I told y'all, I'm still working on my custom. This thing be all, look, <laughs> it's like, nah, it's because I took it off mad weird. I'm all being ignorant. Basically, okay, Ashley, what you supposed to go in there? I'm supposed to get dog food. I wanted a vegetable. Hopefully vegetables ain't been like how they used to be. I don't know what's going on. They got apple face. I don't really need my wallet. Don't leave my wallet in there, right? I know. Um, what else? I was supposed to get some facial wash, even though I said I was gonna wait. I'm probably gonna wait and get these um the bath bombs or the shower things and my my tree hut because I'm down to the last one finally. So let's go. I don't like coming to this one because it, this, this, this is real ghetto. How they out of how they out of tree hut stuff? All they got is watermelon sense. You know, 
And I'm surprised that's here. And this one is all broke. Oh my God. How much I want to bet? I spent like seventy dollars in Target. You want to bet? Cause y'all, y'all wasn't paying attention to me. Y'all wasn't watching me. <laughs> y'all. Y'all ain't gonna guess how much money I spent. <laughs> Alright, y'all. So, <laughs> I spent a hundred. Y'all see, when I went in there, it was light, right? And it was dark. A hundred and thirty dollars. <laughs> Somebody put me on a budget. Now, but seriously, honestly, this is the time that I normally, I promise y'all, for some reason, from January to, like, June, I don't be spending no money. This is my stack season. So, I'm gonna, you know, because the holidays is over, I think the most I'm gonna do really is for my mom's 60th birthday. And that's in April. I'm gonna save up or whatever like that. And then I have a wedding to go to. But y'all, like, I'm about to. These vlogs gonna be entertaining, but we ain't gonna really. We gonna we gonna find. You know what I'm gonna do? I got it. I ain't even gonna say nothing because I'm gonna just. We gonna we we gonna this this gonna be. I got it. I got it. I got it, girl. I got it. I got it. Y'all, I know I said I wasn't gonna uh, eat nothing crazy, but literally I have to go pick up this dog. I'm hungry. So I'm finna get me just some potatoes just to keep me over. Cause it's 5.30 and I, I literally got out of the gym at 4.30. If you see, that's what happens. You know what happened? I had to, I want K-Cups for my, for my new uh, Kira egg or whatever. I, I like, I better be, I better drink coffee at least once a week. Cause I'm, I'm going to be tired of myself. Like, did I just do this for the aesthetic? Did I just do this? Because I was being influenced, or am I really gonna use it? Cause like, don't get me wrong, I use my coffee maker, no bull. I really do use my coffee maker, but I don't use it like that for no coffee. I drink more tea than anything, but I have coffee. You know what I'm saying? I drink coffees on my real sluggish days, like when I need that <laughs> that little. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Okay, thank you. That was it. You was gone. You was gone. You was gone. You was gone. Y'all was gone. But yeah, like, I don't know. Like, I don't know. But I really, I, I really do feel like I'm going to be drinking, like, you know, not every day. I'm, I know I can't be a, a coffee drinker every day. But I, I, at least twice out the week, I feel good. Twice out the week, I feel like it's worth it. It was only sixty dollars. It's them damn K cups. I thought this damn Target said they was on sale. I need to look at my receipt. But anyway, y'all, I thank y'all guys for get, helping me get it together for the beginning of the year. I thank you guys for coming along with me. I thank you. I love y'all, y'all. So I don't know if I'm gonna take y'all, but it's about to be. I don't know if I told y'all sometime in this vlog, but y'all, I'm about to change the look. Okay, it's time. It's been overdue. I'm doing want to try something. That's my last big splurge until, like I said, my mother's birthday. That's it. After that, that's it. That's it. That's it. But y'all, 
I thank y'all. I love y'all. And we're going to have an amazing year, okay? I'm We're we going to keep each other on our toes, okay? You feel me? Like, we're going we gonna to set these goals and we're going to accomplish them, okay? So, baby, until I see y'all. And yeah, when I call y'all, y'all better answer. I ain't playing. When I call the phone, y'all better pick up. Don't be sitting there. I see sometimes y'all be sitting there rejecting my phone call. I be seeing it. But when I call, you better answer. Love you, y'all.